Sharon is joining us live on the broadcast. Sharon, there could have been better ways of giving a political response to what uh, Rahul Gandhi had said. And yesterday also we saw a lot of political parties doing that. But the manner in which Tejinder Bagga has put up these particular posters, which clearly are extremely slanderous in nature as well. Well, rightly pointed out, Aditi, there could have been a better way of uh, uh, sending uh, the dissent message to Rahul Gandhi when he said that none of the Congress men were involved in 1984. And in fact, we are seeing leaders from Sikh community are coming and uh, giving open challenge to uh, Rahul Gandhi uh, for debate. Uh, but this kind of message that has been sent by uh, Delhi BJP leader Tejendra Bagga, uh, it seems as will not go down well, the, well, well with the Congress party, though the Congress party has not come up with any official statement regarding this poster. Uh, but this is clearly in a bad taste where former uh, uh, Prime Minister Rajiv Gandhi has been uh, called the father of a mob lynching. Even when I was speaking to uh, Subramaniam Swami, he also said that this is in a bad taste and it could not be right. Though he doesn't agree with what Rahul Gandhi said, but this poster, uh, could the message could have been in a different way and a more subtle way. But this is not mm. the first time that Tejendra Bhaga has come up with such controversial things. Uh, earlier as well, if you remember, when uh, the Supreme Court has asked uh, for a ban on uh, uh, for firecrackers during Diwali. He was the one who was in fact distributing firecrackers among kids and among other people. So clearly he is some someone who uh, is known for his extreme opinions and his views and he has put up uh, different kind of posters uh, with controversial statements. So once again he is uh, uh, coming up with such statement uh, but what will be the Congress response is something that we have to wait and watch for Aditi. And leave aside uh, getting support from the Congress, it looks difficult that Tejinder Bagga will get support from his own party, the BJ Sharon, you had a word with uh, Subraman M. Swami, BJP member of the parliament. Let's listen in what he had to say. Well, I don't agree that uh, uh, Rajiv Gandhi was like that. But he was misled by Arun Nehru at that time, who was a dada. And of course, uh, later on, Rajiv Gandhi realized and you know pushed out uh, Arun Nehru. But that doesn't excuse the fact that he was the Prime Minister and this horrible genocide took place. So therefore, uh, for his son now to say that Congress Party is not involved is absurd uh, and stupid. And I think the Sikh community deserves to be supported for this horrendous, idiotic decision of Operation Blue Star. Uh, 